Chef Justin Timoneri here with Fresh from Florida, and today I am super excited. We are making blackened Florida grouper sandwiches. That's right, the classic Florida blackened grouper sandwich. Now this is a fun, simple, and easy recipe that is incredibly satisfying. So I hope you guys will make this at home. I've got three really nice pieces of grouper here that I've cut. And then we want to take our fillets and hit them really nicely with this blackened seafood seasoning that is made right here in the state of Florida. I want to give a really nice crusting coat of this blackening seasoning on our grouper fillets. Our fillets are seasoned. We want to go ahead and get these in the pan. We want to be very careful when we're putting our fish fillets into a hot pan. We want to lay them away from us so we don't splatter anybody. So our pan is extremely hot. We got a nice sizzle going on here. We want to let them cook. We want them to continue to cook. We're not trying to burn, but we're trying to develop this really good blackening crust on the top of them. Okay, our grouper is in the pan. It is cooking nicely. We've developed a really nice crust on the top of these grouper fillets. That nice blackened crust is really going to be crispy and delicious, but it's time to start putting together the rest of the things for our wonderful blackened grouper sandwich. I've got some red onion, some Florida tomato, and a little bit of Florida romaine. So let's go ahead and get these cut. Let's slice these tomatoes with our serrated knife. Slightly thin, but not too thin. We wanna make several nice slices and then we can lay this out. Once we've done that, we can go ahead and take our Florida romaine and we can chop this. But I really like the shredded romaine on my sandwich as opposed to leaves of it because I think it gives it better texture and really holds in some of the sauce that I really love on my sandwich. Then we'll take our red onion and make some really nice slices, thin slices of red onion that'll go great on our sandwich. So now that our fish is about done, we can go ahead and assemble our sandwiches. I'm gonna take the bottoms of each bun and add a good amount of our remoulade sauce. And then we're gonna go ahead and add our tomatoes our lettuce and our red onion. Take these and add them right to the top of our sandwiches. And there you have your blackened Florida grouper sandwiches. These look incredible. So make sure you go to followfreshfromflorida.com. Check out this recipe and many, many more. And don't forget to check out the Fresh From Florida Club. We've got all kinds of great features on there where you can even email me your culinary questions and I'll get an answer right back to you. So in the meantime, remember, keep cooking.